say, do you like mystery stories? Well, we have one for you. The concept, relativity. That strange, fantastic relationship between time, distance, and math. Okay, hello, I'm Mr. Oli. I'm the team coach for the Aspen Grove UBC Physics Olympics team, and we're going to do team introductions. So uh, I'll take over. Okay, first is what's your name? Emlyn. And what's your specialty event at the um, Olympics? Just everything. I'm just pretty, I'm great at everything. Great at everything? Yeah. Do you have an area in physics that's a, a strong point? Uh, vectors. Vectors. Oh, yeah. Oh, Next up, what's your name? Walker. And what's your specialty event uh, at the Olympics? I don't know. I helped build the spinny thing. The spinny thing. The pre-build <laughs> event. Yeah. Um, what about in physics? Oh. Sure. <laughs> I don't know. Like... Like modular, theorem. modular theorems. Modular theorems. Fermat's last. We're disproving Fermat's last theorem. Yeah. Yeah. As a warm up yeah. for the event. Yes. Yeah. What's your yeah. Uh, What's your solution <laughs> to Fermat's last? Zero to the four plus negative one to the four equals one to the four. Okay. And what's your name? Jason. Jason. And uh, what are you looking forward to most for I'm the event? I'm looking forward to seeing if our people project will actually work. Okay. So I'm hoping it does. Um, next up is Cameron, and what's uh, what's your specialty event? Probably physics. Just general physics. Yeah, general useless knowledge is helpful. Yes. How long have you been training for the uh, physics Olympics? About a week, probably. About a week. That's pretty good. Well, my whole life, depending on how you look at it. Yeah, there we go. Maybe now. Next up is uh, Sir Callum Philippe McRoberts. <laughs> okay, Walker. Okay. And uh, what's your specialty event? Winning. Winning. <laughs> how long have you been in training for the Olympics? About the past five minutes. And is this your first physics Olympics? No, this is my second. Okay. We're making a come Cameron and I are making a comeback this year. Yeah. So you guys have got the experience. Yeah. And last up on the team is yes. and <laughs> what are you looking forward to most? Um, when Callum wins gold. Oh, Callum wins gold. When Callum wins gold. Correct, the, uh, the trophy and all. And you guys <laughs> have you guys discussed who's the flag bearer for the opening ceremony? Oh, do we have a flag? <laughs> <laughs> this is our flag. Okay, we have to make a flag. Okay. <laughs> flag. I, I, I know the, I know. Right, the entire S. Hey guys, Callum, give me a constant that you know. Uh, Gravity is 9.81 to the. <laughs> that would do. No, no, <laughs> no, uh, no Avag Charles, give me a comment. Avag Avag Avagatros is 6 times ta oh, okay. 6.27 times 10 to the 23. Okay, good. <laughs> Chaz. Speed of light, three times ten of the eight. Oh my goodness, guys. Cameron. Cameron's gonna just go. What did you say? Go on, Cameron. What? Give me a constant. Uh, nine times nine newtons times meters squared over two longs. What is that? I got different gravitational constants. Jason, what's your constant you've remembered? Bacon is always good. Bacon is a constant. Walker. 3.14 is pi. <laughs> wow. 6.67 times 10 to the negative 11. There we go. You guys are set for that Fermi <laughs> round. <laughs> Don't break the pre -bell. So we have <laughs> six. Like that? Yeah. Students, one teacher, really and it. one massive. And one really immature. Ginger kid. And the yeah, very M1 mature. All of us, yeah, grade 11, 12, 12 level. Emlyn, mental equivalent of a grade 6. Yeah, okay, Cameron. <laughs> Guys, how are you feeling? Yes. Ready for this Olympics? Yes. No. <laughs> yeah. 
Ready yeah, as yeah. 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 Sure. We're like the Jamaican bobsled team. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, oh. You bastard. So, what are we really made of? Dig deep inside the atom when you'll find tiny particles held together by invisible forces. Everything is made up of tiny packets of energy born in cosmic furnaces. The atoms that we're made of have negatively charged electrons whirling around a big bulky nucleus. The quantum theory offers a very different explanation of our world. The universe is made of 12 particles of matter, four forces of nature. The universe is made of 12 particles of matter, four forces of nature. That's a wonderful and significant story. So flowers that little things behave very differently. Nothing's really as it seems It's so wonderfully different Than anything big The world is a dynamic mess Of jingling things It's hard to believe The quantum theory Is so strange and bizarre Even Einstein Hey guys, you just had your event, how did it go? Uh, oh, it was pretty yeah, good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. We went first, and uh, the fan broke. Not our fan, their fan. Uh, they had to get an industrial fan. Yeah, so yeah. that happened. Um, how did you guys do? <laughs> right now we're six. <laughs> yeah. Eight. 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 <laughs> so, we beat a couple of people. So that was a really good team with a yeah. fan that got 50% efficiency. They had like a thousand times what we did. more efficiency than us. But I think it's because so. of the JavaScripting change. Yeah. yeah, we're a bit suspicious, but... Well, your uh, design seems to be unique, what do you think about that? Um, well, they don't have anything to drink out of now, we yeah. do. <laughs> we, we certainly wouldn't stop Yes. What's that, Callum? We got brownie boys. If this, yeah. was, if this was on the side... Okay. Yeah. Well done, guys. You did well. Yeah. Okay, we're at 97 centimeters, so one meter is much more than one meter. It's way lower than that. Get his head around in the quantum world, the world of particles. Nothing is certain, it's a world of probability. The quantum theory offers a very different explanation of our world. The universe is made of 12 particles of matter, four forces of nature. The universe is made of 12 particles of matter, four forces of nature. That's a wonderful and significant story. It's very hard to imagine all crazy things that things really are like, are like, are like. Electrons act like waves, no they don't exactly. They act like particles, no they don't exactly. We need a theory of everything, we need a theory of everything. Which is still just beyond our grasp, still just beyond our grasp. We need a theory of everything, we need a theory of Perhaps the ultimate triumph, the ultimate triumph of science.
Hello. We'll give you another spot. Yes, thank you. But that's the last one. All right, thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> Day at the physics Olympics. <laughs> um, pretty sure we had the uh, Pride and Joy uh, pre made experiment, so I'm happy about that. Looking forward to ice cream eventually. Yeah, very sad. Jason? Yes. <laughs> Do you have anything to say? Any reflection on today? What about regret? It was, yeah. it was pretty regretful <laughs> having to watch a project that we had spent 20 hours on fail horribly twice. So that was a heartbreaking. I found it pretty fun. Um, that was pretty fun. Twenty hours. It was like watching a car crash in slow motion. Oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> but any, any final crash. thoughts? Are you reflection on the day? Highlights, lowlights. Not quite as demoralizing as last year, but close. Right. So progress. I call it more considering. <laughs> Emily, so first hard. time Olympian. No. I cried for like two hours after our project failed. It was pretty sad. It was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no one. No one he the entire. Can you, can you explain? <laughs> expand on that a little bit more. I was fun watching Alan cry after his. Alan you know, invented the atomic bomb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It was. It was actually pretty fun. It was yeah. fun, but demoralizing at the same time. And hopefully, regret will make good firework, firewood. So, uh, yeah, mate. Serious, serious fault. It was. It was fun. Yeah. It was kind of funny. But demoralizing. <laughs> Finally, demoralizing. It was like. Say, do you like mystery stories? Well, we have one for you. The concept: relativity. That strange, fantastic relationship between time, distance, and math. Before we're finished, I think you'll agree that truth is stranger than the strangest fiction. Why do the stars shine? Why does the galaxy light up? E equals MC squared. That is the engine that lights up the stars. Energy turns into mass. E equals MC squared. That is the secret of the stars. That is the secret of the stars. Now listen carefully. The faster you move, the heavier you get. The energy of motion turns into m, your mass. Energy of motion, energy equals mass times the speed of light squared.